Hey, how's it going everyone? Sarasota Tim. I've been buying a few things online. I've returned a couple of things, but this one I'm very excited about. It's from WeatherTech. You've heard their floor mats. I already took it out of the box, but I haven't tried it yet. These are the window shades that go in the uh, windows of the Forerunner. And it's black on one side. I'll open them up outside and show you when uh, I get out there. But I'm going to be putting the black side out to make it look like I have dark tinted windows uh, rather than the silver. So we're going to see how they fit. But this was $200, bucks, $185 shipped. And there's eight window shades because there's eight windows in the Forerunner. And I got the full kit. There's also a bag you could get for $15 this goes in. Uh, maybe I should have gotten that because, you know, it's going to be kind of a pain storing this in the truck. But it does have this Velcro strap. And they should give you the bag, you know, for what you paid, but whatever. They're custom made, and you don't need any tape or anything. You just press them in the window. So let's go see how they work. All right, here we are. We're outside. I got the Forerunner open here. I'm going to take these off. And we got to figure out which ones are where. <laughs> so many of them. I know that this big one is the front window. It's got the cutout for the uh, rear view mirror. I'll do that one maybe in a minute. I just want to show you guys like one of these doors. Now they are labeled. Let me pull one out here and show you. This is the, when I look at it on YouTube, it doesn't show the black in true color. Does that look black? I hope it does to you. It is very, very black. And then you have the, the silver. And it says on here, I think this is the back window actually. It says on here, <laughs> remove before driving. So that says rear. And it has this tab here that you can just pull them out on. So whatever side you're using. So I want to try putting the black side out. Let's see how this, how this works. Let's just... First time, you're seeing it? First time with me. Holding in there already. Guys, if they all go in like this, it's worth the money. Unbelievable. Man, that was easy. So now I'm gonna close the door and take a look at how dark and incognito you are. <laughs> you can't even see it. See the silver. If you if you're sleeping back there, it looks like, you know, you're hiding in there. You're you're you know, hiding out in your truck. This is cool. Supposedly the dark side is to draw heat in uh, for the winter, but I don't believe that it reflects heat or makes heat. I don't think they even work as far as that goes. Maybe a few degrees. So let's try uh, one of these over here on this side door. Got this window right here. So let me see which one's what. These are the tiny little back windows back here, I can tell. And this one, is that gonna be that window? I think it is. So we started at the bottom. Just kind of get it in there and just start pressing. Let me get my little, my little thing there. Man, these guys, these things, they just go in there and stay. Like, wow. Oh, I was going to do the black side. That's how they come out, by the way. Oh, so you would use the other one because when you reverse them, so that's going to be this one now. Look, you just boom. Look at that. Man. Man. I hope they stay. I really hope they stay. Everybody on YouTube said they're worth the money. They're expensive. Let's see. I'm going to close the door. I'm going to slam the door. Oh, yeah. You cannot even see them. This is what I like. Oh, my gosh. I love it. All right. Let's do one more. Let's, let's, try, the, uh, let's try the other window on the other side. Or I'll tell you what. I'll do the front. I'll do the front, uh, 
passenger door. It's got to be this one here. Pretty big. I'm sure, I got the wrong one. I do. I do not. I have the right one. So you just place it in there at the bottom. Wow. Kind of a snug fit here on this one. Man, are they they're laser cut. So awesome. Yeah, they're not going anywhere. They fit in there perfect. That little border stuff, I'll show you. This right here, this is a quality made sewn on uh, little thing there. But yeah, they're, I love that you don't tape them or anything. But let's take a look on the side here. Yeah. Now, when uh, the kicker is, everybody on YouTube talks about the front window, come around here, is the problem where it doesn't, it doesn't fit. Um, you, you can always see a little sunlight coming out. So let me pull this off. Go ahead and pause that a minute. All right, guys, I went ahead and took the liberty of putting a couple of them on there uh, to make the video a little shorter. And let me make sure I got it right one for the right window. They go in so fast. I did those uh, those back small windows. We're going to show you how dark it is inside the truck too after we get them all in. I have to say anything about any of them. This one is a little kind of pretty good though. I see this one window here. Maybe that's this one. I don't know. This one goes right here. Like I say, I like the dark side facing out. All the YouTube videos show the silver side out. I want to show you guys how dark it's going to look inside this truck. But the real tell is going to be how that front windshield goes in. And now here we go. Let me get it out. I also want to show you a video in here. The um, little windows here inside. You can just show the one on the, the other side there. I went ahead and put those small ones in. I got eight windows, guys. Eight windows in this four runner. So here we go. We're going to the front windshield. It's a beast. I'm going with the black side. You know, because people can see in on the front window, there's no window tinting. It really um, kind of would look normal with the silver side out uh, because that would be like the normal thing. But I'm just gonna go ahead and put the black, black side in. I'm gonna find out how good it fits around this really strange window the Forerunner has. Big window to get up in there. Okay. You see already that this is probably not conducive to the black side on the front window. This has to be more, this doesn't fit. That's, that's a shame. This big box here, let me turn it around. I hope it works. You know, the 21 has this new thing that shows you the uh, lane assist deal. Is this gonna fit? Let's find out guys. All right, we got a fit. Good. All right, so the box side won't work in the front because of the this cutout over here. But man, it looks like it fits up in there nice and snug. You gotta go around. I'll send Tammy over there to go do it. Oh, gosh. All right, get in here in the driver's seat and sit down. We're gonna show you how dark it is when I close these doors. They gotta come around through a two-step process to do this front window. 
Man, does this thing fit perfect. Everybody has an issue right here with them not fitting in right. Just got to keep pressing and getting it in there. But as you can see, it looks like I'm going to have that same. I mean, it's not a big deal. Like so nobody can see in. All right, that's good enough. Okay, we're gonna. Woo, let's turn the air on. Put your foot on the brake. All right, closing the door. You ready for how dark it is? Okay, take a look at me. Watch this. <laughs> Wow, I do have night mode on my iPhone 13. I see a little crack back there. I'm sure I can fix it on that window right there. Very, very little. And then this here, let me turn a light on so you can see me. I got these LEDs I put in, you know, as a, a modification I did. Well, I have to join the group, guy. My reviews, uh, my review is awesome. Go ahead and pull the trigger. They're laser cut. They fit perfect. Nothing is ideally 100% going to leave, you know, like a little, a little crack. It's always on the front window as well. But all of my other windows are absolutely perfect, including that huge back window. Turn this light on. Show you guys very happy now let me do before in the video I'll go out and walk around the truck showing the silver side out on the front window and the dark tinted glass where it looks like I don't have anything other than my front window which is not unusual for someone to have on their vehicle turn these out here we go we open the door let there be light this is awesome Okay, take a look at this. First of all, have you ever seen a better uh, front one? You know, most of them are those accordion looking, wavy looking things. So that just looks like, hey, he's got his window shade up. No problem. Then you walk around. This is what I, this is what nobody does on YouTube. You're seeing it first here on a 4Runner. Dark tinted windows. Even when you get up close, you really cannot see. You cannot see any shade uh, privacy things in there at all like so many people are doing. Now this one here, you do see a little something, but you don't know what it is. Uh, there was something right there as I walked by in the sun that I could tell a little something. But you know, like here's something you can see. But you know, it's very incognito. And of course, when the sun is low, see right now you're getting a little bit of a tell because the uh, the sun is out. But if those were on the silver side, you'd be really seeing them. You can go ahead and shut it off, Tammy. Put your foot on the brake and push the button. Thanks, Tammy. So you look at the front, Tammy, with the silver. It just looks like I was telling the uh, people out there on YouTube that it just looks like a car parked with the front, you know, window in, windshade. Mm -hmm. And it doesn't have that wavy thing either. It's just a nice mm -hmm. fit. And then on the side, here, take a walk around here. Show the guys one more time. Look, it just looks like tinted windows. You can be totally parked anywhere and no one would know you're back there sleeping. Like I say, when that sun goes down lower and it's not being, uh, or it's a cloudy day, so you can't see uh, like it's showing a little bit right now. But as soon as it gets, you know, five, six o'clock at night, yeah, you see it a little bit right there, but nothing like the silver side. But later on, you won't see it. Guys, weathertech.com, I'll put a link in the description below of the uh, company and you can get some. 
I have no affiliation with them whatsoever. I receive no compensation from them whatsoever. But I would ask, if you did enjoy the video, please hit the like button so that YouTube will share it with others. And I appreciate you watching. All right, guys. Have a great day.